This is what I've been doing in the background. Very slowly, very casually. Muk Galahad. A little, little uh, mecha gnome doing some magic and that. I was doing a little bit of leveling of little Muk Galahad here. Little arcane mage. I'm going to be honest, I've been really enjoying the arcane mage. I've been enjoying just doing it as a little background thing. And in some ways, it feels more... More smooth and natural than using the warrior that I've been using. Now, I don't know whether that's just because I've taken a break away from the warrior. But in some ways, it just feels nice. Um, I have no idea. I've watched a couple of videos on supposedly how you're supposed to press certain buttons and in what order and whatnot. But I think it kind of seems like at the moment until you're, you know, level 50, 60 most of the key things you can press aren't there also how nice is that bring that to me right now i need some breakfast give it to me give me your delightful little peaches muscular chef man i may not can manage at the moment they are fun yeah i'm i'm really liking it kelthar really liking it yeah you don't have most until 80 kind of yeah, I thought so. I thought so. Because, I mean, we've got all sorts. Also, it's weird that this trinket thing pops up. But if we're going on purely based on leveling then. So I'm level 29 at the moment. Level 30. And then we should have unlocked... Um, the whatchamacallits, right? I went from Mania Warrior to a Mage in Shadowlands. And totally get that sentiment. Yeah, I just, it just feels, it just feels nice. I don't know what it is about it. It's quite satisfying. But it could also just be that it's fresh to me and you, you know? Mage has crazy hero talents. Those are the ones in the middle, aren't they? The, uh, this, the middle tree in here. So I think what we'll do, get to level 30 and then I can do those time walking things, can't I? Am I right in thinking that? I can do the time walking thing you involve? Let's just do a random follower dungeon. Hopefully that will get us to um, level 30. Yeah. So if anyone wants to do any time wandering things, then absolutely down. The one for arcane summons a firebird when you use arcane surge. Prefer, yeah, I see loads of people using Frost. Tons of people use Frost. Not me. Now I'm going to be talking to everyone, though. I'm probably going to be way worse. That's usually the way with me. Usually the way. You do it. And, and I do realise what you said. Because I remember, Lovro, you saying that, like... I was acting as if it wasn't going to be spammy. And I now realise that, actually, it's more spammy than I thought. Much more spammy. The only thing I do do all the time is not target people, which isn't a great thing to not do. Do you know what I mean? Like that. So basically, you just spam this one at the moment. So we're going to hear a lot of I need a target today because I'm not quick enough to click stuff, apparently. Also, Austin Huxworth, the little. NPC is an absolute beast. Don't know why he's coming for me. Uh, good morning, Worm. Good morning, Oz. Good morning, good morning, everyone. How's everyone doing? How's everyone going? What's everyone been doing? Fill me in with the details. I want to know everything. But I'm open for um, many, many tips today in terms of the order of play with the mage. Because I'm still obviously learning a bit. And we'll get back to the shaman. Don't worry. Don't worry. We're not just... I'm not hop hopping around too much. Enough. But not too much. But enough. I do... Because I don't know whether I should just be ignoring what I'm being told to do, if that makes sense, by the add-ons. I know everyone's very conflicted about the add-ons. 
Too many lab reports. Oof. Being busy. Busy days. That's a steep old thing. Use Arcane Blast and try and stay full charge of the dots under your character. I need to target something. Arcane Blast. These dots here. Try and stay at four charges. What's the best way of keeping those four charges under your character though? What's the best way of doing that, Rafoid? Because that, that's the thing, it's like... I know what you mean when you get those charges but it's like how often do you press certain things you know trying to work it out you build them with blast and orb blast and orb oh you build them with blast and orb so is arcane barrage actually like not that good basically I just left an arcane mage, funny enough. How did you find it, Oz? Because I'm always, I'm always curious. Use barrage when. I'm gonna be honest with you. This, this proc language is gonna be. We need to discuss. We need to discuss what proc is. You use barrage when you get a proc and instantly refunds the charges. More charges make Arcane Blast cast faster and hit harder. Once you get the proper rotations going, you will like the damage. Yeah, proper rotations is going to be the... Uh, it's basically the crutch of my entire existence on this game. Like, for me, what is a proper rotation? Do you know what I mean? I do not have a target. Also, I need to work out that targeting thing. Because I spend so much time. Look at that. Like that. Why is that not targeting? Just then you got clear cast, which lets you use arcane missiles. Yes. Which buffs your next two arcane blasts. So I should. So use the missiles to buff the blast. So what you should do, like a missile, should I missile then blast then? Like missile blast. Build it with... Oh man, okay. Okay, this is fine. This, wait, why is it, why are they so weak? Why do we think then that the... The little thing, the little add-on is telling me so much to use the, um... So that uses that, and then I should use Blast more. Because it's better. And I should use this thing, because it gives me more charge. Okay, interesting. A little surge that gives me these. But then if, in theory, I wish I could do that thing on the move. It also just looks cool, doesn't it? Let's be honest. So right now I'm just in the spam mode of barrage. Is it better to, for me to take time and use arcane blast than it is for me to use barrage? Missiles, blast, blast, missiles is the core rotation. Missiles, blast, blast, missiles. Proc means when a chance to happen. If you want to move and shoot, be a hunter. Oh, is it that much easier? Spamming barrage is terrible. So don't spam barrage. Should I, should I just get rid of, like, how do I, okay, 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 we're learn, I'm, I'm learning, this is good, this is good. Use Bizarre Barrage when you get a proc that instantly refunds the charges. How do you know when you've got that proc, though? Does it pop up on screen or something? 
Okay, spamming barrage is terrible. Okay, no spamming or barrage then. Sure. No spamming off barrage. Fine. Missile. So I should do ma missile. Blast. Ah, oh, so annoying when I have to don't click on it. Missile, blast, blast, missile. And what if you don't have a... So what if you don't have... The missiles, at, if that makes sense. To begin with, if I don't have missile, what do you use? Just anything but barrage, basically, unless you got proc, which gives back the charges to go back to doing a missile. Barrage is a spender fuel charges. Keeps spamming blast to get a proc. Okay, understood. Get a proc. You don't have it yet because Mr. Tan, so it's hard to explain when you're missing a lot of stuff. Okay, so let's so basically just level through and then we'll be able to take stuff away, add stuff in. Most procs are what make certain buttons glow. Okay. Or your F will give you clear casting too, which is for missiles. For example, Arcane Orb. Okay, okay. So basically, I'm trying to build up the, 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 the proc thing by using my blast. I need to target something first. And then at that point, if I've got four, what what is this clear casting thing we're talking about here? Have come to stop us. This clear casting. I need to Google what clear casting is. For example, Arcane Orb gives you one charge per target hit, so if they're three times, you get max charges back, so you can Arcane Barrage and then Orb. The winds are always in my favor. So here I should use the Orb to get the charges in order to use, use it like that. Whoa, alright big boy. How's that? I'm miles away, leave me alone. Okay, interesting. Clear casting is the two curved lines that pop up in the middle of your screen which allow you to cast missiles. Oh, these here. Okay. You didn't need to use both orbs though. So the orbs, don't look at the orbs as like damage then, you look at them as like a different thing. What's up CK, how's it going? Yes. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I'm with you. Blast. Use this. Use this. But if I'm doing that, how do I get the num how do I get my uh, missile back? Oh there you go. So Arcane Blast does get it eventually. Oh shit! I'm doing way more damage than spamming barrage already. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. What an idiot. Oh, dear. That's so embarrassing. That is so embarrassing. Do you know what? I was do doing major, like, major TikTok brain. Yeah, CK. Um, I, was just, I was just having fun leveling up in the background the Arcade Mage because I've been seeing... Who do I watch? The people I watch play World of Warcraft most all seem to use a mage, and then I was like, I felt, I felt inclined to go that way. Arcane Mage is definitely one of the most technical DPS specs. Well, if I can learn that, I can learn anything. So that does significantly more damage if I'm just patient and don't spam those. Curious then. Okay, so I know I've got the add-on, and I know that we are 
we are confused or conflicted about add-ons. It's not really that hard though when you get into, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So the add-on, why on the add-on, if it's supposed to show the optimal thing, is it showing this? My theory is that the add-on is only for when you've got certain amount of classes. And so really this thing on my screen is pointless at the moment. Morning, Big Zesty. What's up, Dens? How are you doing? How are you doing? Pleasure to have you this morning. Bring in that, that Scottish energy. Come on. Yeah. See, I suppose that's always the danger of add-ons is like... What I've been doing is following it, and, and uh, really I shouldn't have been. Which is fine, but, you know, live and learn on that. Arkham Blast is your main spell, you want to stack it, then burn it. Because what does it do? No, 80% additional damage grants you 1.5% of your maximum mana and hits one additional nearby target. Okay, okay, okay. Morning, Ice Spud. How's it going? Um, I'm talking about the... It's called Helki or Helkili. Helkili. I think that's what it's called. I believe. Thanks for the follow, Hoggle Boy. Hell yeah. Come on in, baby. If I'm missing anyone over on the old TikTok, which I am, which is terrible. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, man. I've missed so many people on the old TikTok. My bad. Hi, everyone. Hi, everyone on the TikTok. Apologies. I didn't get anything popping up on, on uh, my screen. Apologies. I see you all now. I love you all. Thanks for being there. Now I can see you. Tell me everything I've missed. Hoggle boy coming in with the Prime subscription. Hell yeah, Hoggle boy. Thanks for using your Prime subscription. You'll see me at your door delivering your new toilet brush tomorrow morning. First thing. Come on. Um, yeah, I'm currently using Arcane at the moment just to level it a bit. Um, whilst I should be going back to my warrior and things, I think the reality is that I would like at least a few. So why is that not? Why is that an invalid target? Oh, there we go. Because I haven't clicked it. Um, the reality is I'd like to have a few characters that are high enough level. Do you know what I mean? Is that a rotation helper add-on? If so, it might help you configure so more icons. So, it's sort of rotation, but it seems like it's literally just the first one that matters, if that makes sense. Do you know what I mean? The more and more I watch you, bro, it makes me want to build a PC again. Hell yeah, Jack, get on in, man. Get on in. I think I think playing is all about following the right people to play with, Jack, and then it's all beautiful. Thanks for the welcome to the Mage Club, by the way. It still waits for my bidet, you said you were dropping off. That is a big... Big old thing to to get in there. Are you kidding me? That's a that's a multi, that's like a week delivery. I've got to fit it and everything. I post on TikTok. Zara did a great video on here on the arcane rotation. I'm pretty sure I watched that exact video, Hoggle Boy. That's exactly what I watched. But I have to say, like, it's so, he's so good to watch, and it was super clear and informative. But because I don't, I still don't even know the names of everything. I'm having to like look at my game at the same time to try and work out what he's talking about so it's been a learning a learning curve do most wild classic days sean one day i'm going to go and play um classic and actually get a a taste of it for sure um for now i'm just i, I can't there's there's no reason i haven't played it yet necessarily other than the fact that i've been enjoying all this stuff so much in reality which is a good problem to have. And people may say what they will about this game. But I've been liking it. I've been liking it as it is. Holy shit. Okay, okay. I am fully aware that I'm playing with NPCs right now. But usually. Usually when I was playing. Doing these little dungeons. When I was leveling up casually in the background. I swear I was doing no damage. Thank you all. Love you all. You're so kind. Thanks for helping me. Yeah, I think you're right, Lovro. I can't play it, so I stick to Frost. Is Frost actually that much easier than Arcane? Frost is hella fun. I suppose we can always change over to Frost at some point. It's showing you a queue of next actions. Just type hella killing chat and there'll be an option. I'll check it out, CK. 
Okay, we'll check out Frost as well at some point. At some point, yeah. I'm going to be honest also, the other thing I like about playing a mage is that I get to hide at the back. And that brings me a lot of joy. I know that I'm supposed to be like doing damage and stuff, but hanging out at the back, not getting punched that much is actually a beautiful feeling. So I need mana. Oh, so I'm actually out of mana. Uh, so this is my mana. I don't usually deplete it because I'm doing no damage. So that's why I need my little ice buns and stuff that I need to make. You can actually see the fight 100%. Frost is a 2-3 spell rotation on all procs. Thanks for the follow, MJ. MJ. You, sir, you're in the wrong expansion. I am in the wrong expansion at the moment. I'm just trying to get to level 30 so that I can do some of the time walking or whatever they're called, Dungeons Chelsea. But I am, I am in fact in the wrong thing. Yep, true story. Lovro, you are also insane at the game, so that could be part of it. Could be the fact that you're literally very good. Arcane basically is a burn class. You have burn phases where you basically want to rinse all your mana and then use a spell to get it all back every two minutes. Do I have the spell to get my my mana back yet or not yet? So the Arcane Surge, in theory, automatically gives me access to what we're going to call these things. These procs or whatever you're calling them, right? Would that be, would I be correct in saying that? Someone was telling me about tab casting or something the other day which is obviously something we'll we'll look into but so many things for me to look into let me loot this boy what is that noise thanks for follow Avacella. fantastic name by the way I missed my target oops Okay, so good news. We're doing more damage than I was before. Is it a lot? Not really. Is it more than I was doing? Absolutely. So I can't complain, really. Welcome on in, Avacella. Sorry, let, I'll, let me let me power through this, and then I'll have a I'll I'll read the chats. Oh look, there's a look, there's a little fox there. Hello, little fox. So now would be a good time to use that, right? In theory. Oh, I'm going to get absolutely destroyed by that thing. i use one of those again. I'm guessing here, so please do correct me. But what's my best AoE then? Why are you doing Dragonflight Dungeons? Just to get to level 30. And then I'm going to go and do... Do the other ones. That's all. And because you can do follower dungeons, and because I was uh, hiding from being not very good at the game by doing follower dungeons until I had some people to come and care for me. There's the actual reasons. Now you know. That's why we're doing the follower dungeons. But we'll, we'll get we'll get onto the other the main ones. I'm just trying to learn a little bit about the Arcane Mage because I think by playing by myself, I was evidently, well, I was basically doing things which were not helpful to me at all, essentially, is what I've gathered now. And that's just from being told briefly by you lot. Can I teleport out of that? What the hell? That's not cool. What the hell? How could she just run through that like it's nothing? Oh, because you can, I see. Understood, understood. Oh, no, 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 don't step in that. That would be bad. Who's this? Oh, we got infusing person. Oh, I could block it. I didn't realize that I could just block it like that. That's kind of cool. 
Too far away. I need an add-on which tells me when someone's too far away so that I don't look like a fool spamming it. I mean, I know that I'll look like one anyway, but you know. I accept that. So I'm assuming there's going to be like other, other skills and stuff that I learn that I can use to like regain mana and also to power up quickly. I know I'm using bad lingo, but you know what I mean. Let's see what everyone's saying. This dungeon in Mythic Plus was hell for me. I can imagine in M Plus it must be horrible. Uh, in range for healer, augmentation evoker. Apparently the evokers are insane. I saw, I've seen lots of people talking about the evoker, saying that they're crazy good. Thanks for sharing the stream, by the way. One four one four one five six two. Absolute legend. Looking into chopping on and getting my B day delivered and installed. Okay, thanks. Yeah, yeah, okay. Sorry, Dens. I'll get to it. I'll get to it. It was a big... I had to find a lot of equipment from a lot of places for it, so... So, Robes of the Depths. I need to go and sell some stuff. If you couldn't tell, I've been hoarding. Maybe slightly, just a little bit. Need a tank for faster queues. Uh, yeah, absolutely. By the way, sorry, I didn't see... I didn't see you. Right, so we're nearly at level 30. In fact, this should get us to level 30. So if anyone wants to do some of the uh, little time walking things, let's do it. He's I am I am an absolute hoarder. AJ, huge. I love it. I, I did actually sell everything, but I've just accumulated loads of stuff quickly. Use gain the Titan's crumbling power, increase intellect by 95, reduces each time you use an ability. Let's use that. I don't think I've got that. Any of that. Right. Level 30. Boom. Let me go sell some stuff. And then if people want to do some some bits, then I'm I'm down to do it. Go into this little place over here. Sell some sell some cookies. Hello, big boy. Was about to do time walk myself. Hell yeah. Okay. Let me copy and paste your name. Let's see if I can invite you first time. This would be an absolute miracle. Ah, uh, you're unfriendly. We friends on um. Are we friends on uh, Battle.net? Are we friends on Battle.net? Thanks for the follow, Mister Lostfen. How is it going? How's it doing? How are you doing? Probably just gonna sell literally all this stuff to be honest, because I'm not gonna use any of it now that I've got better stuff on. Doesn't want that item because he's rude. Uh, 22% upgrade that one. Okay, so whatever I just put on is garbage. Sure. If you just send me your... I think I've got your battle net. If you just remind me of your battle net name, I'll just send you an invite via battle net. Mystery box? What's that? Preserve this in its rightful place. Perhaps patrons at the bar with a roasted ram or bartender himself will know more. Yeah, just let me know. Let me know. Oh, this is that one over by the bank that we took. Last time we did this, the first time I was here, no, not even kidding, this mission, I got lost in the bank for maybe 10 minutes. It was embarrassing. Boom. Sent. Sent. I've got so many friends now. I'm so popular. So popular. How are you finding the new player experience? Bumbaclad25. Um, do you know what? It's tricky because I suppose I'm not that new anymore, really. Um, well, I'm a month old, so in you know, World of Warcraft terms... I'm young, but uh, to be honest, it's, it was just like the learning curve it was so aggressive at the start and it kind of still is whenever I try anything new. 
But now that I don't feel like a stranger using a mouse and keyboard so much, and now that I know some of the areas okay, it's way easier. I still think it's um I still think it's a, you know, um a bit painful from time to time, and that's usually why I'm I'm in here trying to get people to guide me because I need it. Why he say your name like that? Because that's his name, AJ. Are you kidding me? I think Peckman is still in his 30s. <laughs> first few months is going to be getting used to the gameplay. First years is going to be getting to know the game. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. And, and that's it, isn't it? It's, it's like learning anything new. To begin with, you're always going to be bad at it. But the more you do it, the more you try different things, the more you do badly the better it can be. So at the moment, I'm just working from like, not dying 10 times within a dungeon or a raid, getting that down to five, and then it'll be three, and then two, and then one, and then we'll be there eventually. How are you leveling this character questing? A mixture of everything, Harry, really. Um, just trying to do some questing, gonna, we're about to do some of the time walk dungeon thingies. So just doing everything. You know, the more things I can play with people, the better, ultimately. Um, I don't mind going to do old expansions. We've got the Shaman who we're doing Draenor with. Um, and we've got... What else have we got? We've got something on Legion. And then we've got this new new little lad who's um, doing everything else. Mr. Lost Finn, hi. How are you doing, Mr. Lost Finn? How are you going? By the way, do you know what shifting power does? I do know what shifting power does. Shifting power, draw power from within, dealing 602 arcane damage over 3.7 seconds to enemies within 18 yards. Cooldowns reduced by 12 seconds. So basically... Oh, that yawn. Oh, Mr. Lost Finn. What the heck? How's it going, Scout? How are you doing, my friend? I absolutely do not already try stream viewers. Absolutely not. He even followed me. I was like, I had, I, I had faith. Are you new to WoW or have you been playing for a while? Cosmo Barry. The answer is, in WoW terms, not not long at all. In any other game, I've been playing for a while. So I've been playing for about two months. Probably more than that. Yeah, two months. Two months exactly, actually. Is where we're at, Cosmo. Going good, just tilt at other rep paladins not doing propitiation in heroic raids. Aren't rep paladins supposed to be like one of the best things in the game at the moment? Am I right in thinking that? Also, does anyone else want to come along for these dungeons? If not, we'll just run them and I'll, I'll make some poor people really upset. Yeah, super easy. We're at a crazy at the moment. We're at Paladin is piss easy. <laughs> but people... <laughs> I don't think I've got Touch of Magi yet, no. Let's have a look. We've got Shimmer. I, I'm sure at some point we're going to have to look through all of this. We so aren't the best in the game. What do you think is the best, Abby? We're good. I love to join, but I'm in Bangkok at the moment and don't have a PC here. Hell yeah. How are you enjoying Bangkok? I'm very jealous. I'd like to be there as well. Could follow the guide to max roll. What is this? What is max roll? Yeah, I mean, at the moment, I'm kind of just clicking, I'll be honest. Click and hope. Slow... Council reduces its cooldown by four seconds. Gain a shield. What what item level? Or what level? For everything, for guides. You can just spam blast. Okay. We'll definitely do it. I think I think I'll, some of that stuff I'll have to do off stream because I don't want to just. Otherwise, I'll just be here like, what is this for? So take shimmer, Roger. Okay, 
Beautiful. That's 80. No, 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 no. This character is level 30. I have a level 80 warrior, spicy. Congrats, that's awesome. I've probably been playing for around 10 years. Is mage your favourite? It's hard to know because I've been playing around with this mage for not that long, but I'm really enjoying just the feeling of it. If that makes sense, I'm just enjoying playing as a mage because it feels magical. <laughs> but you know what I mean. Um, but the warrior is the main one we've got. Um, but I'm really enjoying it. It's raining pretty much all the time. That's why I'm sitting in my Airbnb and watching TikTok. Well, I hope the rain stops for you in Bangkok and you're able to get out there. But I hope you're enjoying your Airbnb in Bangkok for that reason. So, you know, not too bad. Enhanced DK, Fury, Warrior, Archimage. Nice, Abby. Nice. Oh, enjoy being there until October. Have you been there for a while? Have you been there? Away? I'm feeling magical, baby. Come on. You can use it to blink while casting. Blink whilst casting. So let me, let me, let me, let me, let me. We need to get more keybinds going, don't we? That can go. Oh, I'm trying to keep things simple enough, but it's just going to, it's just not the case. You just can't do it. So Shimmer. Teleports you 20 yards forward unless something is in the way. Unaffected by the global cooldown and cast ball. Gain... So that's quite good if you just want to dip out the way. Oh wait, actually it kind of works over here. Um, let's actually do... Let's get rid of that. Let's... What do I want to do here? Should we put mass polymorph in there? Let's polymorph some people. You definitely need prismatic barrier. Arcane intellect is something you don't need binded it's a one hour buff oh this one the r1 okay so let's use that and where's my blink this is i got rid of my blink am i just being crazy or does blink disappear because i've got that So many things to look at. Oh, this one. This is what we're talking about. Prismatic Barrier. Shields you with Arcane Force, absorbing 802 damage and reducing magic taken by 25% for one minute. Oh, shit. That's pretty good. Okay, let's put that on. R is where it is. They replace it. Okay, okay. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Sweet. All right, okay. Last, last, last duty call. Does anyone want to come on and do one of the time walk things? If not, we'll just go as a as a pair. Thanks for sharing the life again. I'm out of spells and it's crazy confusing. I'm returning to WoW and I've been trying to watch people to learn, but they all have these crazy amounts of spells and it's just confusing. You know what, Sean? Me too. Me too. I think I've just taken the approach now that it's okay to not know what's going on and to be bad. And so if you're coming back to it or just starting out, I think the best thing you can possibly do is like, just don't deep it. Just let it be. If you if you can't do a certain thing or get through a certain area, it's fine. Just go and just go ride some sheep or something and, and the spells will come at some point. At least that's what I'm hoping because I certainly don't know how to use them. In fact, just this morning, Sean, I'll have you know that I was spamming the wrong button the whole time. People came in, told me what to do. Funnily enough, my damage doubled. So, <laughs> I play Frost Knight, Frost DK, and Survival Hunter. Thank you very much, Cosmo. A pleasure, a pleasure to have you in. Uh, do, 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 do. I have Blink and Shimmer bound to mouse side button, so I can whip and blink out stuff fast. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. I might put that there. Get rid of that. I don't like that there. I should actually conjure a little snack. What snack is it going to give me? I hope it gives me muffins. It's not It's not going to give me any muffins though. Is that for me? A little snack? A little refreshment for me? I'm pretty sure I can't eat it. I'm a mechanome. What meat did it just give me this? There we go. A little bit of pumpkin pie action. What's up big dog? Dogs? How are you doing big Tom? Big Tom T JC baby? 
Easiest classic back with BM Hunter, four button rotation, I believe. Ooh, that is good. The Hunters look insane as well. The Hunters genuinely look insane. Yeah, thanks. Is there any classes that are simple enough? I've been playing Balanced Druid so far. Everybody, what is the simplest class to play? It sounds like a lot of people are saying um, Hunter or something like that, Sean. BM Hunter. Yeah, Scout, Scout on Twitch is saying Hunter. BM Hunter, BM Hunter. Yeah, everyone's saying BM Hunter. Go for BM Hunter. <laughs> Stream's going fantastic, as always. No other is easier than BM Hunter. BM Hunter. It's Jimmy Jamal, BM Hunter. Scout, BM Hunter. Zavanditas, BM Hunter. Lots and lots. Okay, I wouldn't mind a Hunter because I get to have pets. Exactly. Exactly. I haven't played a Hunter, or I did for about two minutes, and then I didn't. Okay, I'm just gonna send. I'm just gonna send an, a, a preemptive invite, and then we'll we'll load in. You know, I know. Whoa, you're, what are you doing? What are you doing in Lover at the moment? I'll send you an invite, even if you don't want to join. Oh, you're in raid. You're in raid. How are you talking? How are you raiding and doing this, Lover? Are you sicko? All right, do you want to just go alone? The two of us will go, and we'll see if someone, if people want to kick us out. Not follow our dungeons. All right. So ho hopefully people uh, can't do this in cross-faction group. You can do non q dungeons and raids. Apparently we can't do it as a cross-faction cross group, unfortunately. BM fight close range. Do BM fight close range? I can come on as alliance. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. That non mover build for DH is just so boring. It seems like there's um, BM fight close and long range. All you do is your pet doing damage. There you are. Pets damage, long range, medium range, close range. Whatever brings you joy. But you won't be top deeps or anything, just a soloing class. Survivor is where it's at right now. I'm with you now. It's just pure pet fighting because you get two pets fighting for you. So it sounds like that's the way to go. Okay, right. I'm going to attempt to focus so that I don't get kicked by the rest of the group. 